Okay, what do you do if your Roku TV has a black screen? Uh, well, you're not gonna be able to see anything, right? So we have to use one that does not have a black screen so that you can see what we're doing. Uh, you're gonna hit your home button. No matter where you're at, hit your home button first. It'll take you to the home screen, okay? Now you click your arrow button up once. That takes you to settings. Oh, you're not gonna be able to see it because it's a black screen, right? You're gonna hit the right arrow key one time, and then you're gonna hit the up arrow key one time. You're gonna hit the right arrow key again one more time, and the up arrow key again. Right arrow key again, right arrow key again, and that should take you to this screen, which you will not be able to see. From there, you're gonna hit your play pause button three times. Boom, boom, boom. Uh oh, there we go. If you have audio, you'll hear a boom sound. And then you hit your okay button or the uh, button right in the middle of the arrows. I'm sorry, you can't see it. Uh, just hit that button right in the middle of the arrows and you should hear another bloop sound and that should reset uh, your audio and picture settings. It's, it's at least worth a try to see if it's a settings issue. Uh, if it is a settings issue as to why it's a black screen, that fix, that'll fix it. If it's not a settings issue, well then, yeah, the problem's a little deeper than that, right? <laughs> anyway though, that might help some people out. Uh, obviously it's not gonna help everybody out from that black screen, but it will at least help those that it is a settings issue. It'll help you out.